Hello there, I'm Colonel Fager, and this is Trackfield. When you were last around, we started to look at replacing some of our older engines, uh, some of our older trains, with, uh, with new up-to-date, up-to-date material. Uh, this, the Amusing Express, is our, uh, our latest addition to the line. Um, and, uh, yeah, it's doing all right. It's making us a bit of cash. Uh, it's not the quickest, neither does it have the greatest capacity, but it, uh, it is a standardized model, which means that as I need to replace the others running this route, I can, uh, I can stick similar on there and maybe more of them. So it's, uh, it's running our big commuter line, which we have spoken of enough. I have been a man obsessed about the big commuter line. So we've got other trains we need to replace. And the most significant one is our wretched, wretched cargo line down near Tewkesbury. Right, so this was something of an engineering triumph for uh, almost five minutes. Uh, well, what have we actually got running at the moment? So here we go. This is this is our new addition here. This iron ore train, which is currently carrying 17 of 65. You kind of go, well, why doesn't it wait till it's full? Because if you wait till it's full, the rest of the iron just leaves of its own accord. It doesn't wait at the station for anybody. It is a pain in the backside. However, there are options available to us. Now, the first of which we could link uh, this iron line up to this track. So our iron train would probably put a, a split in, in the middle of the tunnel somewhere, which <laughs> that's, oh, yeah. that's easier said than done. Oh, typical. You make new trains, new trains become available. Um, we could put a split in the tunnel to take it out to here, pick up whatever's available, drive back down to this one, pick up whatever's available. Round we go out to our steel mill. Now, the other thing we need to do. Steel mill, at the moment, can only handle one train at a time. There's only one track. And look at all these goods leaving. They're going of their own volition. We are not uh, doing anything to... Uh, to actually speed those to their destination and uh, and drive populations up and drive demand and all of that kind of good stuff. It's not properly optimised. And uh, and so many corners have been cut when actually setting the thing up in the first place that it's, it's, it's somewhat miraculous that it's worked at all. So what do I need to do? Well, what I need to do is, is change that for the better. Right, we've got no one in the train station at the moment. We need to get this uh, aging crocodile replaced, if nothing else. And then we need to replace, well, quite a lot, really. So here comes our coal train now, which is K3040. And it's a double length because it's got goods on the back, so it will pick goods up and drop them off on the way back out. So far, so good. I've got the money to spend on this. Uh, I just want to make it work. Is that so much to ask? Other alternatives. Okay, well, let's look at other alternatives. Uh, we also have a very productive steel steel mill, which we're currently servicing with trucks. And frankly, it's making me money, so I'm, you know, I'm reluctant to muck about with it any more than I need to. Uh, yeah, it gets a little bit carried away and does the same thing once in a while, but there's no reason we couldn't link up both these steel, all the resources on those two steel mines and steel mines, steel mill, and, uh, and get them working. Anyway, we'll worry about that later. First things first, we need to replace this chap, which means as soon as he's dropped off, we'll send him back to the depot. Come on, drop off, turn around. Get out of here. Go to the depot. Thank you. Right. All right, smash it. We'll then replace him with something else. Now, the question is, am I going to replace it with one train or with two? If I'm going to replace it with two, I need to build a bypass for coal because we can't run the coal line up here with the goods, or can we? We need a siding in place there, at the very least. I think we can possibly get away with it. Let's pause while the track's relatively empty. I think we can possibly get away with it. If we double track this section here, put plenty of signals in for trains to actually hold their position, 
Well, you know me. Uh, I would rather try it. Actually, let's put uh, let's put electrification in from the get-go, shall we? Oh no, we're going to have to post electrify these tracks. All right, fine. I'm, I'm, I'll get over it. What's that? That's a high-speed track. Right. Let's go from why from there? Why what what? Yeah, I'm, I'm not surprised. What what's going on here? Do I need to delete a little more? Okay, okay. Interesting. This is, I, I mean, there's going to be a lot of trial and error goes on here. I want to warn you of that now. Right, so what we definitely want to do is run double lines out here. Oh, interesting. I've not seen not seen collision like that before. That's very strange. Okay, we're going to have to delete that one. Let's not link it up. Let's just run it out straight. Nope, you're going to have to delete further. I said I'd got the money, right? Yeah, well, that's not going to last long, is it? Straight line, and then let's get you on board as well. Okay, everybody's on board. Okay, the hope is that uh, we go. if we run that round to connect to there. Okay, so iron is coming in down this track. Currently, we have coal and goods coming in down this one. Now, there is no opportunity for them to switch which track they're on, except at this kind of uh, switching area to get into the station. However, I do want the station to... Uh, to be able to handle more than one train at once, because otherwise it's a big bottleneck. So, as much as it pains me to do so. Deleted. Now this is going to set us back a little bit. Anytime you, uh, uh, anytime you delete your uh, your stations, you are uh, setting yourself back away. Hopefully, hopefully that was in the right place. Otherwise, I'm just unnecessarily hemorrhaged more money. No, that was good. All right, cool. Right, and a little bit more deletion required. Good. No. Oh, why are you colliding? That's very strange. run the other way and see what happens. There we go. Happy now. Okay, and we're going to want to build up just like that so that uh, we can switch lanes, switch lines, and, uh, and actually get people to and from the depot, which is also pretty important. All right, cool. So we've got a whacking great station here. You, my friend, just have to make use of it. We can get two trains in there at once. Uh, we have the option of... Now, everybody wants to drive on the right, remember that. So they want to go up this way, and then they want to come down this way. That's fine. Let's put another switch in here. Just so that people have the option to go on whichever side they prefer. Uh, but we'll uh, we'll probably plan that out a little more thoroughly. Right, next trick. Uh, the next one's the expensive one. 
one is where it will run this coal bypass. I can't see another way of doing it because we're certainly not in a position to delete this station. Are we? I mean, that's, I mean, I built it without properly thinking in the first place. Well, actually, I, I built it thinking that uh, I'd only ever want to run one train with both coal and goods. How wrong I was. I think we'll leave that intact anyway, so that that option still exists. But hey, let's go crazy and see where uh, where we can get to. I mean, that's a, that's a nice, uh, nice million quid investment there. Was it coming out? So, where do we want to go? We want to come through here and then onto there. Equally, at the same time, we want to set up to, uh, to harness the power and the majesty of this other... Wow, everything here is going to cost... Let's do it. Look, if we're going to do this, let's uh, let's just do it. So, ore train comes out, comes round, uh, well, comes round, and then in the tunnel, instead of going the way it's going at the moment, oof, that was not cheap to make, though, was it? Some say it's impulsive. I say it's decisive. 1.17 and it's is that a constant slope or what nope that's that's all on the flat okay this may limit our options this may have been a very foolish thing to do no see you can't you can't create a junction inside a tunnel so our survey comes back with the uh, with the understanding that that was in fact rash, and may even lead to that being a waste of a million quid, given that the tunnel comes out right at the edge of the station, and I've got no choice in the matter. Can I do this? Can I? Can I? I wasn't expecting it to allow it, and that's probably why it's not allowing it. Okay, well, what we have got, looking on the bright side, is we've now got a tunnel to another ore mine that is unproven. Come on, there will be a solution. There will be a solution. A solution will present itself. Okay, well that's there. Yeah, that's a potential. Solution. No, no, it's not a potential solution, though, is it? No, you're going to have to make this work. Which would mean relaying that pretty much as it was before. Which it won't do because we're now. Oh, whoa. okay, you've blown a million quid. Live with it. Still, adventurers in the future are going to have all of these lovely tunnels to play with. Right, first things first. First, we want to link this station to this station, right? Okay, 900 grand. Ah, let's call it what it is. It's another million quid. Now, is this leaving enough above land that I can get? Yes, it is. Probably. Okay, there's the tunnel. Right, now that means that we can send a train from here to there. Look, I'm stating the absolute obvious, but uh, otherwise it's this, this is just going to be a large amount of woe inducement. Now, we need to loop around this way to there. Ooh, crazy. Not go all the way in one minute. Let's go to about here, right? Right. 
and then can we then take a spur off from that onto the other roofs, which construction failed. Really? I wouldn't have thought it would fail that. Really? Okay, good, 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 good. And then we want to get both of those on the track. I remember when I built this originally and it was really expensive. I'm glad nothing's changed. Okay, right, now we can go both ways. Remember, I've got to electrify all of that. So the train can come off here once I've linked it up. If I can link it up. That's another... That's a, not a problem. Great. Okay, so the train can come off, go up here, Make a pickup, come back down, make a pickup, head back. I know, you're thinking what I'm thinking. I either need a bigger train or I'm going to need two trains so that it's it's getting the frequency it needs. Uh, yes, that's very true. Okay, we're going to need a... Well, let's do it the other way, shall we? Which way is going to be best? All right, so now we need to make sure that these these two pieces of track here are single direction as much as possible. All right, so I want to queue up one side. This is going to be interesting. Okay, right, one more thing to do, and that's to get our rail... Uh, rail... This is all rail, you fool. Uh, to get our uh, our coal system operating uh, with this uh, with this change in, uh, in philosophy. Right, where are we going? Let's go a little close to the action here. We're not going to go all the way over there. Or there. I think we're just going to have to delete the tunnel. We're basically taking a don't think about it too much attitude towards construction today. That goes up, uphill a bit. It's almost like I'm saying to myself, can I make it any more expensive, I wonder? Hold on, let's see where we're actually going before we. Uh... Whoa, 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 I don't need you doing that. So this is actually going to land on the, uh, on the goods line. I thought for a moment it would actually let me connect there, which would be a, be something of a first. Right, we're going to have to do it in two parts, so let's go out to here maybe. And then we're going to have to come out of there and hook up to either this ugly S, which I could now change. In fact, I could radically change. Except, of course, we do need to worry about this main line coming back in. Hey, that's something that's uh, that's still yet to come, isn't it? Right, okay, right, let's put that there. And then find a way, my friend, find a way. Let's do it. I'm crazy about this plan and I'm excited to be a part of it. Okay. Right. So, in theory... In theory, that's all the track I need. Now, let's get this rebuilt. Brace yourselves. Oh, why have you changed your materials? I quite like those old stone bridges. Not least of all because half of it's made of that old stone bridge. Terrain alignment collision. 
three of my favourite words all at the same time. What are you terrain and rowing colliding with? Could it possibly be my glorious new rail? How far am I going to have to go for you not to be terrain alignment colliding? Equally, let's not go off that side because that's the easy side to go off. Let's go off the difficult side in terms of collision. See those old, old stone pillars had no problem. You're just weak willed. This is proving way more expensive than I originally planned. Which I believe is the, the title for this series. Proving more expensive than originally planned. We're still colliding, right? Okay, what can we do about that? Can we do it? Now, it could just be because the points are underneath there. Now, I don't really want to lay that down in order to test this next theory out. Sod it, I've burned enough money already. I'm gonna burn a little bit more. Oh, of course you can't. Okay, so. Let's do some deleting here. Right, this is a given. We have to be able to do this, right? Obviously not at that height. Stay at a standardized height and you're still colliding. Well, that's just because you're awkward, isn't it? Oh, apparently you're colliding with this. Did I just delete things needlessly? Can I delete this and get knotted? Live to my train track, I demolish your house. Okay. Let's lay this along here. Maybe if I'd noticed that before, I would not have just deleted a point section that wasn't exactly the most straightforward. In the world. No matter. Look, I've made my choice on, on construction materials. Now, you know, stop harassing me. as far as there. Let's get the second line out. Bridge pillar collision. What are you, what are you on about? I'm not trying to lay it on top of each other. Uh, you know, you're supposed to be running in parallel. No, no. No more than usual. Right, come on, let's go to the other side first. I, I'm prepared to spend everything I've got in making this flipping work. We're colliding with a house that is nowhere near anything. It's going to cost me another half a million to purchase. Screw you. green tick that is. Now is that high enough to get a train under? Would I be wiser to put the track under? You would be wiser to put the track underneath first. And then what have we got already? We had, we had one new set of points already set up. So we can go that way. To get onto that line if possible. Go. Right, nobody interfere with my plans. Or 
that will be the yellow. Good. Is that straight? Yes. Do not give me any crap about not being able to do it. You know, I need this, I, I need you to comply. You pile of crap. Now, I mean, if you could lay double track in, in one go, that would be a useful feature, wouldn't it? Look, can't you recognize what it is I'm trying to do? Because frankly, otherwise, why have I got a double station up here? There is no purpose to it whatsoever. If I can't lay double track up this bricking slope, Right, I'm not going to. I'm not going to. No, that's that. No, you had a chance. You could have been a hero, but you're not. You're a gigantic waste of space. Look, see how I'm pointing at this one? That's the one I wanted to go from. Today we're playing a game called Comply or Be Deleted. Right. Okay. Then we'll merge this line onto that one painlessly in a way that nobody will complain about. Good. Right. We're just going to have to make it something. We're going to have to do something. Uh, but not now. Right. Next up, electrification. And I'll do that in the next episode. Thank you very much for tuning in. Uh, I know it's always hilarious to watch me completely failing to get anything done. But these things need doing. Next time around, we get trains running on these lines again, and they're going to be incredibly profitable, or I'm going to burn someone's house down. Thank you very much. My name's been Colonel Failure. Please like, please subscribe, please comment. Thank you very much. Cheerio.